Hey there everyone, it's Sangod aka Zero here. Coming back to playing Tales from the Borderlands. Uh to be honest, I actually forgot what happened in the last episode or in the last part. Uh I think we actually I remember we electrocuted a bandit. We sat there and got in our car and well found Reese and Vaughn, thanks to Loaderbot, throwing Athena halfway across. Sorry, halfway across the city. And we got in our brand new truck, thanks to Scooter. And we have headed off to go and find wherever the Gordis project is at. So let's hop right back in. Scrags! So many of them. Oh yeah, we found this weird place. No more bandits. Bandits. Eh, they haven't lived here for years. The Crimson Lands massacred them. Some say their corpses still roam the streets seeking vengeance. Sasha. What? Sounds like fun. Not to be a downer, but I'm not seeing any Atlas facility. I'm mostly seeing dry trash. Would it be so hard for just once something to go according to plan? Enough of this standing around crap. Let's get moving. All right, guys. Sure, it's not a fancy resort town, but we're not here for a day at the spa. We're looking for a top secret military facility. Don't Thank worry. You. We'll figure this out. Pretty sure I can figure this out. Just gonna scan everything. Clyde Trap, <laughs> your new best friend. <laughs> I don't know how many of you actually played Borderlands. How many of you actually did? And wanted to throw Clyde Trap off of a cliff and watch him just explode? Because I was seriously one of them. I wanted to just get rid of him. So many random billboards. Ooh, a gun. But we can't have it. Alright. It's, it's very fast moving. Mushrooms. Poison level, like the worst. Huh. Well, that's a nice thing. Well, look at that. <laughs> Looks like we're on to something. Hey guys, guys, come check this out. It's like the whole grid leads right to here. I mean, with all these power lines everywhere, they've, they've got to be connected to something, right? Sorry, I was getting a drink of water. Let's scan the box. Power junction, okay. Ha, <laughs> here we go. something hey that sounds good right good sound you keep hacking I'll go check on loaderbot yes go check on our giant 
awesome robotic keep a junk. I want to talk to Loaderbot. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi, Loaderbot. Uh, I don't see any loot boxes. Or anything I can actually... What the heck was... is that? Huh, when in doubt, pull something off the wall. And... there we go. Let's just open you up. <coughs> Aww. You belong here, I think. Maybe this? Oh, that's not good. Let's see, how about if I put you... Here. Okay, let's see what that does. Nope, it just moves that. Maybe the last one? I I didn't hit that one, I hit the last one. Maybe this? I put it for the last one, not the second one. <laughs> Sometimes this control does not like me very well. It seems to go extremely fast. Okay. Put it to the last one. I think I'll take the first one over that second one. There we go. Alright, that's two. Hey guys. Hey. That's a nice sock. Can I put back? Oh, really? I mean, because, you know, a, a good pair of socks is an often overlooked detail of a gentleman's wardrobe. I'll try and remember that. Yeah, so... You want your boot back? I would love my boot back, yes. Don't say I never gave you anything. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. There we go. Got my boot back. That's better. So... What did happen back there with, um, you know, the... Why do you ask? No. Oh, sorry, it's, it's... It's none of my business. He got greedy. That's all there is to it. All right. Well, um, I'm gonna get back to it. We'll be here. Huh. The sign says go down that way, but I kind of want to... I don't know if I can actually go. Doesn't think it'll let me go over here. Huh. The ground's different between here and here. Examine the dumpster. About all doll was good for, am I right? <laughs> yeah, no one cares. There we go. Yeah. 
Ew, gross. Glad I got my shoe before I put before I did that. Okay, so I can't go back there, so there kind of goes exploring. All right, let's just open this up. Point that thing. This is incredible. Pristine, preserved Atlas architecture. Yeah, and it's the real classy corporate stuff, not that military garbage you usually see. I'm with you, boys. This looks good. How about we find out if the inside's even better? No, 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 no. We're going in cool right now, okay? Remember? Remember we talked about cool? Cool. So cool. I love loader bot. Like we're in the right place. Yep, that's ominous. Just a this dead is body. a massacre. Friends and Lance, these guys are serious badasses. Watch your step. Whole place could be booby trapped. If this place is as valuable as we think it is, they might be trying to protect it. I don't see any signs of sensors or tripwires or anything like that. But hmm. still, you might be right. What the hell did this? Not what. Who? I can give you a wild guess. This is Athena's handiwork. Starting to think we might have just gotten lucky with her back there. Whoa. Ooh. Fancy. No goody. <sighs> Seriously. Recent bond, new little playmates, right? It's very good to meet the two of you. It's a shame we couldn't be meeting under different circumstances. Bond, Reese, you didn't think I'd have August handling all my dirty work, did you? Oh my God, I am so sick of this. Would you just? Screw off already! I bet there are loads of other people on Pandora you could be tormenting. True. But none of them have the Gordis Core. Loaderbot! Arm weapons or something! Uh -huh. Uh-huh. Come on, guys. You didn't think I'd come all the way down here before grabbing a universal remote, did you? What? The Gordis Project, the two halves of the core, everything leading to a vault. We got it all. Checkmate, amigos. I am shame. 
No, loader bot. What'd you think, Reese? That you could pilfer something from my toy box, no strings attached? You never could follow through. That's your problem. And that's why I beat you every time. Oh, your payback's coming, asshole. I don't know how, I don't know when, but you're gonna make a mistake. And when you do, <laughs> I'll be there. Sure, sure, I'll, uh, bring flowers. Yeah, you'll bring foot wait, flowers? What? <gasps> Ow! To your grave. Because you'll be dead. Why is it always the face? Oh, you guys would not believe the dream I just had. Holy crap. Wait, 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 wait. What, what, what the hell is this? Didn't I just do this with this guy? Kiddo, I admire your consistency, but, uh, God. Oh, and who is this princess? <laughs> wait, they... Yeah, yeah, that son of a... Shock other people. Thank you. Oh, yes. I knew about that. Um, don't touch the cores, August. Thanks for the heads up. <laughs> Jackass. They're gonna have to do it for us. You'll cooperate, right? Because I figure if you don't, well, I, I can think of all sorts of things to do to your little friends. <laughs> yeah. Like, we're just gonna give this gorgeous thing to two scumbags like you. <laughs> it's cute you think you have a choice. Two hallways, two halves. I'll, uh, take my soon-to-be-dead janitor here. You take my fancy hat down the other one. Boys, you keep an eye on these two. Especially this one. Don't believe a thing she says. Oh, how sweet. Their relationship yeah, is a little odd. Tight. Get your hands off me! Either of those two move, you shoot them where they stand. Reese, I'll admit it, you and uh, Vaughn have impressed me. And that sort of thing doesn't happen often. I'm surprised you've made it this far. Oh, yeah, Hugo Vasquez, Hugo Vasquez. There's, there's something I remember about this guy. What the hell really? is it? Really? It's unbelievable. He must have had some sort of help. Couple of death jockeys like you. I'd say it was 50-50 he'd survive the landing, much less get as far as you have. Uh, my friends are out there. Okay, they're the reason. We actually... Oh, we actually make a good team. Oh, that's sweet. And now you're all gonna die together. <laughs> I guess so. Bummer. Just when you were making friends. I mean, you might think of me as a self-made man, and for the most part you'd be right. But there was this time when I looked up and admired one man in particular. The most impressive person He's I've gonna ever known. say me. Handsome Jack. You idiots always say me. Still can't figure out who he is, though. We had the special report. He would do this thing where he would punch me in the face whenever he'd see me. It didn't matter if he was busy. He always made time for me. No, still nothing. I, I punched my mom, for Christ's sake. Just boom, right in the kisser. I was drinking from a mug when he got me one time. I hate to break it to you, Vasquez, but what... You're describing you don't is... get it. You, you don't get it. You don't. The point is, I was his punching bag. Oh, man. He thought we were exclusive. That's adorable. I miss our time together. Ah, this drives me crazy. It's right there. It's on its own. But through me, his legacy carries on. you get paired up with an asshole like Vasquez? No, he's not so bad. He's just a little dumb. A little? Valerie, woman I work for. She's got a lot of contacts up on Hyperion, Vasquez being one of them. Problem is, we tried to cut her out of the deal. Hmm. Obviously, that was a bad idea for a lot of reasons. The fact that the vault key was bullshit being first and foremost. Well, 
Valerie found out about it, so now we've got to convince her that whatever comes out of this room is worth more than the $10 million deal we tried to slip under her nose. Then, hopefully, she doesn't kill us all. <laughs> she ever talk about me? What? Sasha, did she ever talk about me? You guys Ooh. are sisters. I figure you'd talk every now and again. Just curious if she ever mentioned me. She thinks you're dangerous. Yeah, well, I am. So that's fine. Maybe that's something she likes about me. It's yeah. not. You killed a guy right in front of us. Don't you remember? Oh, right. Yeah, that was rash. You think? But listen, that guy? He was a bad guy. He's ripping my family off for years. Just stacking lies on top of lies until he couldn't remember what the truth was. And he had plenty of outs. He chose not to use them. Look, I just want you to know, as far as you and I are concerned, there's no hard feelings. That is so generous of you. I'll think about that when you shoot me in the back. Come on, don't be like that. You're the one that hustled me, remember? Not sure. And that, you see, is what I was trying to provide for you. Some guidance, some mentorship. A father figure. I was trying to help you. The janitor gig, it was to test your metal, your resolve. And I gotta say, you reacted with some balls, kid. Some big old balls. You see, Reese, I started at the bottom, and I worked my way up. I, uh... <laughs> I used to be in the mailroom. Whoa, wait a minute! Wallet head! That's where Jack found <laughs> He used to be bald and he was going through these hair implants and, and, and I did it would stick money to his head. It was, <laughs> it was hilarious. Uh, but it was a long time ago. A ask him about it. He'll tell you. Ask him about it. <laughs> go on. Go on, seriously. But that's ask a pretty him. big difference. You know what I've always found so impressive about you? It's that hair of yours. I mean, so natural, so... Realistic. Those implants are just the best. Implants. <laughs> I. I was trying to be nice to you. <laughs> Let's get this over with. Oh, <laughs> that's good. Oh, that's right. Now, when I take your corpse back to Helios, I'm gonna make sure they save me your hair before they start experimenting. Always nice to have options. Yeah. Whoa. That's legitimately creepy. I agree with you, Jack. Huh. Nice little room. <laughs> I can't tell you how much I'm looking forward to getting back to Helios. So there's really the not much going on in this area. Dead. No! Hey! Hey! I just, I just yeah, need some area. That it was just about the money and nothing else. And relationships have to be built on trust. I don't know if I can take Sasha back without it. How do you even start a conversation like that? At this point, I assume she's just embarrassed. You two should just talk. Clear the air, see where it gets you. Yeah, we should do that. Well, here we are. I'm trying to make August kind of... Go on. Stalling won't do you any good. <sighs> trying to make August kind of... kind of think a little bit that maybe he'll come to our side. Come on, are you stalling? I'll be quiet. Come on. There's a little bubble up behind us to protect us. Whoa. Hey, what is this? There we go. No. No, 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 no. Whoa. Nice music. Hey. You guys 
have a nice chat? <laughs> I can't imagine he's too happy with you guys. Uh, at least that's the vibe I was getting. I guess Sasha left an impression on him. Yeah, I could see that. What do you mean? Yeah, what? Uh, no, nothing. No, nothing. Gortis unit ready for assembly. We got it! We got it! I guess that's our cue. is going to get us into a vault. Hmm. Maybe it's some sort of vault key. It doesn't look like any vault key I've seen. Oh, please. The only vault key you've seen was the fake one you tried to sell me. This is true. <laughs> okay! Just grab the thing and let's go. Subsystems, man. I can hack into these drones and I can uh, almost guarantee no one dies. Unless you want them to. Probably. Uh, just let me in. I... Vaughn! It's under control, Trust me. What? No, no. Listen, we can I trust Fiona. The whole facility, kid. We got this. Whatever you're gonna do, Fiona, do it. No, 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 no. You're making a huge mistake. forever. This is how you're saving us? You're just throwing things? No, I, I think it's supposed to explode. <laughs>
next time on Tales from the Borderlands. Well, there you guys have it. That was episode two. Uh, for Fiona's choices, uh, I was actually the majority of the people who actually told Sasha to help Reese, which I don't see why you want it. Uh, I'm actually one of the 28 that per the 28 people in or percentage that actually chose this customization for the car. I'm in the huge majority of the people who. Uh, who did not peek at Sasha's gift. I don't know why you would, it's her gift. And 31% of the people actually used the electrical damage. Which I thought, honestly, was kind of funny just watching him twitch, to be honest. Uh, for Reese's side, though, 78 of people actually told Vaughn about Handsome Jack. That's actually pretty good. Uh, 61 of the percent of the people actually went to Hollow Point. I mean, you could have either gone to Hollow Point or you could have gone here. So, and I don't know really why you wouldn't want to go to Hollow Point. On the fact that Hollow Point kind of, I guess, you never know, you may have to go back to it. So, kind of a smart idea to go there. 88 of the uh, 88 percent of people actually bro fisted Vaughn. That is actually pretty good. Except for the fact that they just kept saying bro repeatedly after that. It got very annoying very, very quickly. Wow, this is actually the first time I've seen a actual percentage that is not point something. But 59% of people actually trusted Fiona over Jack. Okay then. It's... For tomorrow, though, we will actually be jumping into episode 3 called Catch Your Eye, which means good chance we'll be catching up with Scooter again. But, till then, I hope you guys enjoyed. This is Sangot, aka Zero, saying stay frosty, everybody. I'll see you all in the next video. Please leave a like, subscribe, and please leave a comment uh, if there's something that you guys are looking forward to. Uh, I am actually been thinking, not 100% sure on this one yet, but thinking of looking more into the game Prey. If that is something you guys would like to see, please let me know. I will see you all tomorrow when we continue on with our, with chapter, or episode 3, Catch Your Eye. Sangot, aka Zero, stay frosty everybody. Good. And... Bye.